Hi everybody, it's Honest John. Uh, just some random thoughts here about the events of the past week. Uh, first of all, uh, it seems to be really hard for the Republicans to give Obama any credit. Uh, it doesn't matter that he just killed the number one terrorist in the world. They have to find a way to find fault with it. Some of them are even questioning the actions of the SEALs that took bin Laden out. Now they weren't there and questioning the heroes that went in there and got him is uh, kind of unpatriotic if you ask me. Oh and then we have Glenn Beck who uh, called Obama's trip to Ground Zero to honor those killed on 9-11 obscene. This from a racist moron who brought the modern-day equivalent of the Ku Klux Klan to the National Mall on Martin Luther King Day. So if there's one thing that Beck knows something about, it would be what's obscene. And uh, Sarah Palin called on Obama to stop pussyfooting around. Shooting somebody in the face is not pussyfooting, really. And then we have a bunch of people who are saying that we should end all aid to Pakistan. Well, most of the supplies to our troops go through Pakistan. So they are either seriously out of touch with reality or they don't support the troops. And, and think about it, Pakistan has lost a lot of troops fighting the Taliban. And they're still digging out from the huge flood that they had not real long ago. Now, some people in their intelligence services might have known about bin Laden, but there's no evidence that the government did. And, you know, when they talk about incompetence and stuff like that, look, I live in an apartment building. I don't know who lives two doors down from me. And finally, there are the people who want to give the Bush-Cheney torture program <coughs> credit and the Bin Laden raid. Here's a little piece of the truth for those people. When you torture people, you don't get facts. You don't get the truth. What you get is the lie you want to hear. Thanks for listening.